welcome to the first voiced uh, showcase series of a shotgun assault rifle survivalist. It will aim to have a higher constitution, trap skills, instant traps, and um, etc. etc. Really, it is designed to survive the encounters. I got really tired of playing uh, free constitution builds. Um, you know, always like, reload, 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 whenever the smallest thing goes out of. Out of <laughs> not according to the plan. Yeah, dead. It's one shot usually. So yeah, this is this is different. Now, for the red hounds here. Whatever you attract them, you want to stand on that single square just outside the gate. You may get scratched, whatever. But as long as you can't enter and close the door behind you, enough action points, enough movement points. Just stay outside, just one square outside, uh, you know, next turn you will be able to enter and close it behind you and you're safe. So any range builds, except for um, metathermics, uh, can actually stand behind the fence and just, just pop them. Very easy. Now, here I forgot the lockpicks, so don't forget the lockpicks again. <laughs> By the way, I do apologize for my cold. I might sound a bit strange, but yeah. Old Jones here. Um, yeah, get your lockpicks, um, traps, whatever. Now, there's a trick with him. When the first time you enter the zone, uh, he generates his inventory. So, you can cheese it. You don't have to do it, but I always do it. Um, you can get some items for your build really early on, you know, like medicine belts, ammo belts, etc. Uh, I opted this time for electroshock generator, for a taser. He this early in the game he generates like um, low quality ones, which are really good for tasers. Uh, low energy usage, excellent. Now, how to do it? Um, enable auto saves. For the first time when you enter the area, it will save you. And just check his inventory. If he has what you need, save the game, continue playing. Wait for it. You know, once we do this whole quest, we'll hand in the watch and just return it without any items for him, just for free. So I can, he will give you a discount. And he'll help you later on with the Blaine's quest to find Blaine for free, basically. I can pass persuasion check without any persuasion. So, this section here. If you sneak up to the gate, if you can, if you have sneak, enable combat, de stop sneaking, decloak, wait two turns. So, wait basically skip, after decloaking, skip a turn and skip a turn again. More often than not, it will cause all the round hounds in the whole in the area to aggro on you uh, because they keep running and they keep telling their fellas to go after you. So basically, just get in here behind this gate, pop them. Easy, no stress, nothing. Out of AP, <laughs> he's gonna do nothing basically, and he's just line up for you to be killed. But that's the thing. Don't forget to close doors behind you. Um, if you don't have enough movement points, action points, I'll repeat again, just don't go through the doorway. Don't stand in the doorway, just stand slightly outside, one tile. And that's it. You may get scratched, it doesn't matter. Next turn, you pop in, you're safe. Yeah, and as I said, for the old Jonas, just load all the saves until you get in his inventory what you want. Um, but you don't have to do it, you can play it whatever way you want. But, I mean, you will find it, it's all RNG, you know, you may find these things in the next container you open, you may not find them for half a game. Um, so, I always use this chance. He cannot generate, at least this early in the game, he cannot generate... Um, 
quivers and shotgun belts so don't even bother yeah I also um, prefer to get frag grenades um, this early on just buy the recipe again as you see what I did here I just stand outside I don't have enough AP to enter and close so I just stand outside yeah but uh, I usually buy a um, hand grenade recipe and buy a few gunpowders uh, frag cases and make some frag grenades you need 15 alchemy chemistry sorry at 15 chemistry and 10 in mechanics so when creating your character i always do it you don't have to but molotovs are really useful and they need 20 chemistry and 10 uh, tailoring so might as well do it now yeah, this was a good throw and this is an excellent place to use it i mean the battle itself often kill a few of them if you wait and sneak yeah this is the spot basically ideally you want both of his pets next to him and then just uh, throw a grenade at the wall um yeah i messed up the first try and um i had to kill all of them and you have traps you can lay like two three bear traps probably three uh, because the pets will go in first most definitely they have more they start combat and so yeah you might need three of them and it may be difficult but still doable otherwise just one grenade and a good good timing and yeah i'm sorted easy peasy so to say now this build it's great i actually got inspired by knife gaff um, because i had this build previously set to free con and uh, i was more about um, oh by the way this is a randomly generated area each is different i'm not showing this one <laughs> it is just fun i mean experience them for yourself you may not even ever get them uh, but yeah, I got inspired by my guess. A uh, high con, um, low perception AR build. I probably prefer more perception. But yeah, it's perfectly doable. And shotguns. Yeah, lead shot, 3 points, 80% evasion reduction. I mean, you can have, you can have a really shit, really, really poor skill and uh, still get away with it so yeah this uh, this build can actually do 10 con easy 11 perception because we'll have ambush so even assault rifles if you throw a molly or just light them up in any other way like flares or something you can negate half of their evasion and our shotguns will negate 80 percent of their evasion so on dominating it's extremely good now, yeah, this is just another tag, basically, for the last two red hounds, I mean, we can get away, don't need to kill them, but I like killing everything, I'm all out of ammo as well. Didn't find any ammo, didn't find any guns that could use the ammo, so, I still had enough to kill them, though. Yeah, pull them in, wait outside until I have enough AP to move over, and do it. So, that is almost the end. As I said, for all Jonas, just hand the watch in for free, don't ask for anything. It will save you a lot of hassle because you have to spend money otherwise to get the location on Blaine. Uh, if you're doing eels, and I'm always doing eels, and um, yeah, <laughs> really, I mean, the machine gun you can get here is like what? <laughs> it's it's poor 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 money anyways just just hand it in for free you get an awesome discount and everything's fine yeah that's it it's all done 
congrats. Uh, we'll continue outside. We'll do a quick silver quest on the next round. And the Sally, it is not recommended to do it. Because it's almost impossible not to pull red hounds, but you'll see it in the next video. Thank you, and I'll see you next time.